Well, hey there team, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to some more Hard Space Shipbreaker. Let's keep chipping away at this. I'm having fun. Hope you are as well. Uh, I guess you can just start the shift straight away, right? Which is cool. However, we did unlock bloody uh, doodakins, tethers or something, right? Well, we should be able to unlock them. Um, fuck, this menu's so dumb. <laughs> Having to go in and out of each thing. All right. Is that it there? Is that tethers? Hold to confirm. I don't care. Whatever. Um, back. All right, so there's a bunch of upgrades at five. So this is how it's going to have to be. It's not going to have to check every single thing. All right. All right. Employee terminal. So now, what was what was in here again? Certification. Right, and apart from this, just telling me that it unlocks shit. What the fuck does this do? Nothing. Basically, Grandmaster Shipbreaker. Jesus, right? Eh? Lucky me, the Grandmaster. Um. All right, hang on. So we've got new things. Oh, here we go. We've got tier three stuff. Right, right. Well, this might be people's first trip. You know, even though I was a pretty, well, I was going to say big, but a big part of my channel um, was hard space for a while there. So, you know, let's, let's, let's try some different stuff just in case. So what is this again? It is a mackerel, but it's the Exolab version, right? Let's try it out. There you go. We've got core systems. See, now this only has whatever that is. Explosive, I suppose. But now we have electrical wired in as well. What's a... Can we see much of a difference? Oh, yeah, there you go. 23 MP per tier. Yeah, cool. That's nice. All right. And repair kits. That's another thing I haven't been thinking about. Um... Is that your, your weapons and all that degrade and you basically have to spend a repair kit touching them up because otherwise they get a bit faulty. Gunner, it is my distinct honor and privilege to introduce you to the rest of the crew in our sector. All right, well, here we go. Down this off, this might be it. Hey, Rook. Name's Luke. I was the worm until you showed up. So thank you. Now I get to do the hazing. Great. What are you talking about? We don't do that. Welcome aboard. Don't listen to her. I'm Dee Dee. Oh, Nina. Hey, uh, I'm Mike. Kai! Your mic's still messed up. How about now? Better. Oh, hey, I'm Kaido. Hello. Uh, Mike's still busted, huh? Oh, yeah. Still waiting on the wreck to get to me. Uh, Heaven forbid they get a functional gear. I'm sure they're working on it as fast as they can. Yeah. Cutter, I added you to the sector comms channel. It can get lonely out here. How's the check in? How do I turn it off? Time time? That's what matters. All right. Enough chin wagon. Let's get back to it. We were out. Goodbye. Fight. Later, Rook. Oh, well, that wasn't super offensive. Let this fucking gun pull down. There we go. That needs to go on the barge, doesn't it? Oh, shit! <laughs> Alright. Is there a, an option, like audio or something? Like, turn player's voice, title screen over, recent, cinematic... Speech volume. Oh, we might test that. Maybe I can just fucking mute them. If I can do that, I'll be a happy little Vegemite. Like, we, we're still going to give him a chance. Just makes me giggle because I know that Luchik is the insufferable unionizing troublemaker pain in the ass. 
And the first thing she says is, oh, I'm going to haze you. And I'm like, Haha, okay, you're talking to an ex-Navy dude that went through all of that. And it's like, funny how you can joke about that sort of shit. You know? If you joke about na in hazing these days, you will get in so much shit. <laughs> it's like a big no-no. But, no, nah, that's okay. You know? It's sort of, sort of double standard to be honest. Corporation's not treating us right. We need to unionize. Also, lol jokes hazing. Um, here we go. Salvage registered. Transferring credits. All right. Now, because we've got the tethers, we should be able to. Oh, why is the music going creepy all of a sudden? What's this about? What was that? Now, see, I could use the other attachment, but... Okay, but see, it can cut the walls, and I don't want to damage that. What the fuck is that sound? I can't tell if it's part of the soundtrack or if it's like a fucking horn of something going past outside. Well, look, that's an oxygen bottle, I think. Now, I don't think any of these sparks actually jump because I would be very not okay with uh, generating sparks near a compressed fucking O2 can <laughs> in real life. Um, but I'm pretty sure it's pure visual. Oh no, hang on. Um, how do I cancel? How do I cancel? Uh, like Y or something? It is Y. How's that for bloody muscle memory kicking in? It's, oh, it says it on my screen. Oh, well, that's less impressive, isn't it? Don't you fucking do it. There you go, that should do it. There you go. Oh, what is this big bloody dongly dick pit? That's cool. Yeah, see, I don't know what I can and can't cut, so I'm, I'm just reluctant to use that saw while I'm reacquainting myself to the the damage that I can do. It's sort of like a... that looks like a keel, doesn't it? Antenna base? That's kind of cool. I mean, it's totally non-functional, <laughs> if, if it is. I, said, I guess it's part of an antenna. But it's like looking at the bottom of a bloody sailcraft, like a laser or a taser racing yacht or something like that. It looks cool. Alright, what's this? This goes in the furnace, does it? Okay. Oxygen reserves are low. That's alright, look what I've got. Asphyxiation can lead to missed salvage goals. Yeah, I'm excited. All of a sudden, we're gonna let we're gonna let this story. You know what? There might actually be value just laughing at how terrible it is. Not to be that sort of malicious, like not even malicious, but you know, we might get a kick out of just laughing at how how misguided this company was in thinking that people wanted to listen to their fucking story. Um. Can I just rip these things out? Huh. Oh, is that like... Uh oh, hang on. Why was that sparking? Oh. So, hang on. Oh, is this... That's just junk. Is it? Cut level. It doesn't have a designation. I don't like that it's sparking. Okay. Um, what if I disconnect that? Does that let this come off? Oh, it does too. I think so. I think that's what's happened. Yeah. Okay, that's cool. Fuck, I don't remember any of this.
reeling in, baby. Oh shit, no. There's some furnace stuff going in there, accidentally. Oopsie daisies. Valuable object process. Credit deposited. Raw material deposited. Yeah, whoops. This is cool unbuckling these things. I kind of like it. I mean, I guess I could zap them, but I think it's probably quicker to just rip them off like that. I know I can use the split saw to be faster, but I'm still getting used to it, right? I don't have the muscle memory that I used to have. And you just have to bear with me while I go fucking grandpa mode. Done it again, you idiot. Oh. No! <laughs> I can't catch it, it's going too fast. <laughs> right, where's, where's my readout? Tethers yeah, 5, I see. What is this? Is this like a junction as well? It doesn't seem to be anything. Okay. Yeah, okay, I like that. So, so that's sort of like electrical cabling. It's cool. Where am I? Where am I? Who am I? Oh God, I'm dizzy. All right. Now people were saying that you might actually be able to cut this glass out. Now when I look at it, the game seems to consider that whole thing to be glass. All right. So sure. shift clock says five minutes left. You know what to do. We right. go. You know what to do. So if I. See, does that technically damage the glass? I can't tell. You know what I mean? Like, is this part of the pain? Oh. But we figured out that we can somehow unbuckle this. I did it by accident in a fit of random destruction, right? Can I squeeze in here? Yes. Oxygen reserves are dropping. Right. How long we got? Four minutes. We might upgrade my Applying credits to account. Is it worth going back for another three minutes. Nah. We'll just reset our shift bucket, right? Like, what are they going to do? Dock me for daily work? I don't care. <laughs> Let's just go back out there. Have a bloody, have a bloody nap. Dun, dun, dun. Cutter 9346 That's me. Your designated sleep period is now over. Shut up. Have a great day. I will. I'll have the best day. Alright, start shift. Because I don't believe we leveled up, so I can't buy anything. Continue ship. Shift. Okay, yeah. Yeah, 
Okay. Good. I am I am actually really enjoying this. It's great, and I'm looking forward to the more complicated ships. There's, there's, they've added at least one or two since I last played it, and I believe they've added, like, have they added radiation or something? So there's some stuff going on that the old square head's not familiar with. Yeah, so what's this? Is that just a sticker? What am I looking at here? Huh. Nothing that I can cut. Alright, cool. So we did that. Let's go in there and try and understand it. Yeah, because I like the idea of it coming to coming apart. Now I don't want to damage the aluminium behind. Not if I can help it. Just try and keep everything as intact as possible. Pull it all apart, nice and easy. Right. Oops. Whatever. Right. So, was that attached to anything? Or was the bracket attached to this? Mm. Yeah, so help me understand the game. Apparently this can slide apart somehow. Or at least I thought it did. 55 kilos. 200 and... Wait, no. 55. Two hundred and fifty-five. Twenty-nine. Hang on. Why? 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 Delilah. So, yeah, if I try and zap parts of this, it counts as... Yeah, see, it counts as the whole thing. Yeah, right. So I guess you could tactically try and cut it apart. But like, we're starting to get to a point where I don't think it's worth the fiddliness. Anyway, let's let's cut this. Let's just cut this edge all the way around here, because I want to know. It was just like me. Boy, it was just like me. Cats in the cradle. Right, something's floating free, hang on. Cutter, your equipment durability is dropping. Keep an eye on it. Right, so... dangling in the wind with busted tools. What am I? See it happening. Head on back to the hab. Use a repair kit to fix them up. Right, okay. How much is this glass worth? People were saying it's actually worth a little bit. But I don't know. Seems like a... Seems like quite a fuck around to get it out. You know what? The best way to find out how much it's worth? Jam it in there and see how much it docks me for. Alright, let's watch the damage bar. Because I put a tiny bit of cabling in before. Okay. What are you, what are you gonna do to me, game? How badly are you going to slap me for that? Oh, yeah. It's not small. But the trick is, if I can get away... Just let go, just let it go. Um, If I can get away with it, who gives a shit, right? So what's going on here? We've got some boxes and stuff. Computer terminals. Salvage secured. Now, can I repair things from inside the hab, or do I have to repair them out here? No, you can buy repair kits here, but use them between missions. That's how it used to be, I think. It's been a while. It's been a while. So they should tear each other off the wall, right? That's usually how it works. There we go. Oh, whoops. Um, so that's a power junction. So I think that's going to be a pain. Off you go, boys. Um, yeah, the power junction usually jumps, I think. Salvage deposit registered. Account credited. 
box. Huh? Now, I'm pretty sure this is all furnace. Furnace, furnace. Unless there's a door button thing. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Oh, do my tethers carry over? Between missions? Hmm. Oh, that's a break. All right, control is break and shift is down and space bar is up. And it's all a bit weird. Welcome to Vendatron 9000. Um, suit patch kit. Do I have any of these? Tool repair kit. Tools and equipment back in the hab. All right, I'll, I'll buy one of them. I'll buy tethers. I'll buy thruster fuel. Have a nice day. Righto. Did my thing go on the furnace? It looks like it must have. Oh no, there you go. Like It's over there and I can't see it. In you go. Wow, that actually takes a little bit more than just ripping it. What's this? That's a power cell. Oh, I haven't seen one this small before. That's cool. Yeah, no. da -da 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 -da. Well, let's try something fancy. Probably get out of the way. Off you go. <laughs> oh, it's happening. Look at that. Accepted. Not bad. And they'll drag each other in. They sort of get grabbed. It's cool. I'll be honest, that tethering sort of out of the trailer bullshit, it, it didn't really work very well for a long time in the early builds. But I'm surprised with tier one tethers that I can pull that sort of crap off. That's really cool. That's not, that's not how it used to be. At least in the early days. Raw 
materials. All right. You got five minutes left in this shift, Cutter. Before Didn't we have another, out. uh... We were out. Battery... Power cell? Unless it's floated off on its own. Dunno. Dunno! Jeez, we've done alright. Valuable object accepted for processing. Oh, this is interesting. So this floor panel goes to the processor now. Now that used to be aluminium, didn't it? If memory serves. So they've streamlined it because that used to, that used to be a pain in the ass trying to... Can you cut this? Yeah, you can. Okay, they've just changed it to a, a type of titanium. That's cool. I'm all for that because that was always shit. <laughs> Ship's no starting to move around too much. Can be reduced through good breathing practices. Please unhook. Okay. Oh shit. That's not what I meant to grab. Just don't want to go too fast. This is a good way to get bashed in the head. Welcome to Ventadron 9000. Oh god damn it, tab. Yeah. Oh fuck, hang on. Yeah, I thought that was gonna happen. Shit. Fuck, let go, let go. Oh, that's how you cancel it? Okay. So why has this gotten jammed up? Oh. Alright. Good bloody thinking there, Scarlet. On the old tippy toes. Mate, I've still got it. After all these years. I can't, I, I really, I miss pulling reactors out. That was always fun. How come my brake didn't want to work then? Oh, you can't blame the game for everything. Scarlet, you bloody dickhead. Maybe it was your fault. So that's all for the furnace, I think. Oh, so is that. Object processed. Transferring credit. Oh, what's this? Fuel? Fuck it. Let's eat that now. Oh, patch kit? Oh. I was trying to figure out what the fuck that was. Oops. See, that's why I didn't want to use that. But then here Good I go job, getting Jenner. overconfident. One minute left on the clock. I think that's our menu. Yeah. One minute? Oh shit. Um, fuck it. Chuck the rest Object. in the furnace. There's a bunch of aluminium in here. There's some titanium. Come on, school me a couple of extra points. Let's go, game. Go faster, 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 bitch. Go! More! 20 seconds, go! Cutter, looks like you used your last tether. <gasps> Head on over to the kiosk to pick up some more. Get in there, get in there. Cook it! Cook it! Oh, no. <laughs> red bar going up. 
<laughs> oh no, that's all right. That's okay. Hey, it was it was worth an effort. It was worth the effort. Worth a try. Oh, we didn't level up though. That's all right. Ready to destroy the next ship. Okay, that was cool. That was really cool. Ah, <sighs> okay. Hello, ship breaker. You have one incoming transmission waiting. Suit. Living space. I'm trying to get around the intercom. Kitchen. Bed. Fuck. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Hey, Rook. Oh, hang on. Actually, let's test this. If we can silence this Sheila. Um, speech volume. Zero. Change. Yes. Oh, he's fixed it. Right. Well, there you go, boys. We might we might have a playthrough on our hands. We might have a playthrough. All right, let's give her a chance. Let's see how long she lasts. Because again, my memory may have faded. I might be wrong. All of you are saying that it's just as bad as it was before, but I'm doing my best to give an open mind. Got real life and all that. Not that that's gonna happen anytime soon. Yeah, I've so been at this for years. Twenty, maybe. I was just getting kicked out of grade school when he started. <laughs> Unsurprising. Dee Dee sends most of her money home. Goes through lengths, of course. With huge so I can't skip it. And I literally can't well, skip it. Look, but I can mute Kai's it. Great. He just Start shift. Hasn't really taken to the work. Lynx calls him a low earner. So what? As for me, I'm trying to get there. Have you never had to hand. manage a team of people at I different didn't skill levels? Get me one of those mining skips. You know, for belt running. Still, so many rich rocks along the frontier line. This is a Wendy's. I don't Unless want to talk to you. I want to hire some friends from back home. The Earth platforms. Round Mars? Oh. Good people. This is like the worst but exposition dump ever. There? Hmm. Don't know when that'll be, though. Yeah, okay. Just when I think I'm earning at a steady clip, there's another fine or fee. This job's fun as hell and all, but I got other plans. I don't care. I don't know you. you. Do anyway, don't want to get a fine for tying up comms? Kidding. That's not a thing. I don't think. Either way, good luck, Rook. Lou out. All right, whatever. So you might think I'm being a bit harsh, and maybe I am. But what's going on here? What's this bullshit? But you just wait. You give it a couple more episodes and you'll see. Hello, right? <laughs> oh, man. What's this? Crack one open. I got a sticker. I don't care. I, I find my love through my work product. Seems like you're getting the knack for it. All right. Trust me. When you get well versed in the art of ship breaking, it becomes a joy to show up to the yard each day. Yeah, I, I appreciate this dude's fervor for the job. Dancing between the ribs of a ship. But I can't skip you either. Oh fuck! I've accidentally started a shift. No, I haven't. Okay. Taking a breather. Gaze out. Right, maybe I can skip him by starting a shift, but I don't want to start a shift right now. I don't care, actually. I, and you never know. Maybe if I save and quit and when I load up again, you'll shut up. Okay, so again, we're here to break ships. That's the fun part. Not really listen to, like, probably the most bottom tier writing ever. And we haven't even gotten to the, the preaching yet. But the uh, sit here locked in a what can probably be described as a prison cell because you can't leave <laughs> until you listen to their their one-way monologue um, and then you can go back to having fun for the thing that you, consumer, paid fucking money for. And how dare you want to skip it? Um, but anyway. <laughs> oh, my God. Anyway, it's still fun, and I'm having fun laughing at this shit writing. So, whatever, let's just go for it. Team, let me know if you want to see some more. Because um, that will make a difference whether we keep going. Otherwise, I might just leave it there for the time being, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.